Welcome to Peninsula Point State Park. We're up in Door County, Wisconsin. And there are several campgrounds at this location. So Peninsula State Park is a pretty big state park up here in Door County. Uh, there are a lot of campsites separate videos for each campground or maybe at least in clusters because otherwise I think this will be an hour-long video and nobody wants that all right I am coming up on Nicolay Bay campground sites 3 32 to 6 or 632 to 644 and a boat launch Start with 632 to 644 to our left. I feel like we're lucky that this one is still open. Six thirty-two on my right up the hill here. Six thirty-four is also labeled here. So oh, so this would be a shared site. You and your friends book both of those. Six thirty-three on my left with the uh, camper there. Six thirty-six on my right. Six thirty-five and six thirty-seven is on my left, another shared site. Although they do look like they can be used individually. I've got a restroom on my left. 638 on my right, 640 on my right, 639 on my left. And that one looks like it, oh, it's 641 on my left. 642 on my right. I've got a little split loop, I believe. 644 on my right. Now, ooh, right on the water. That's a bonus site, right on Nicolay Bay. And probably a great place to catch a sunrise. Six forty-three is a long deep site. I am going to stop for a second and check out this bonus site. Alright, here's 644. It's not a very deep site. Am I full wide? Yes. You got your fire ring down here. Picnic table. I guess your tent can go over there. But you have access and a really nice view. Okay, so that was a little loop and heading back. So knowing that now, letting you know that site 642 is on the water. And that means 640, 638 are also right on the water. Not quite as good a view, but they do have access, shoreline access. And that's probably the same for 636. Oh, they're tucked back in there. I just saw where the car was. It's tucked back in there nicely. So 636 looks like a nice sight. If you want to see the water. <coughs> and the same thing, oh, let me show you this. Way back in there, 632 is uh, someone's site with a camper. And 634 would be the same. Oh, way down in there's a pop. All right, just past those sites, we have the boat launch. And this is not just, this is for motorized boats. Right here on the bay. It's like a beautiful sight. Now 
off of that boat ramp we're going to cross the road to 361 to 301 there's a camp host in here first sight looks like a pull through I haven't seen a lot of those and the numbers are on the other side 631 was the pull through 629 over here over on my left I got 630 that one looks like it has a bit of a water view but not right on the water over on my right here is 627 on my left is 628 I'm kind of going the wrong way apparently because I can't read the numbers until I'm already there so on the left looks like another pull through but with a campsite right on the water is 626 625 is over on the right Another waterfront one over here is 624. Over here is another pull through. On the left is 622, which has access to the water. The first pull through over here was 623. It looks like I got another pull through site. Over here at 621 620 is on my left I do believe this would be the camp host over here at 619 next to the shower building over on my left again with water is 618 on my left here park here camp over there on the water at 616 there's some parking for the showers here so some of these are really nice on the water sites on my left again park here camp on the water is 614 I missed what that one was over here get their car there 615 on my right 613 on my right pull through over here and that is 611 this one is a mini pull through but back in for a tent site as well as this one's a pull through so on my left 612 on my right over here is 609 on my left 610 not quite waterfront here another pull through with a side pad up there you get very creative with how you use these sites so this one is 607 on my left is 608 and I backed way in over there get off the road 606 here it's like it's on the water 605 there All right, on my right is 603. On my left is 604, and we seem to be backing up to a public field to play on. 602 over here with the scamp. 601 on my right. Totally feel like I did that whole thing backwards. But from where I came in, that was the way. I guess I should have come in from over here. Let's go take a look at what other facilities are right here. All 
All right, just off the campground, we have a day use area. There seems to be a store. We'll check that out. See what's here and access to the bay. So I'm at Nicolay Bay Beach here. Nice little beach. This looks like a great place to come and swim. There's a good day use area. We've got a camp store. Um, I think they've even got ice cream here. So you got the beautiful beach. Out there is Horseshoe Island. And along this point if you look over there you might see the boat ramp some of those campsites were along that stretch and another set along that stretch to explore so you do have camping available right on the water in this campground all right another quick perspective horseshoe island out there camping right there boat ramp and more camping along there for a few select sites. And then this beautiful beach right nearby and camp store with amenities available here. So this spot is also a popular spot since it's got the ice cream and a little store here to stop at. Popular stop for the bikes to stop, take a break, enjoy the view and get a snack. So that was North Nicolay Bay Campground. We started up there where we found a few wonderful waterfront sites along there. Then that lower section, there's also quite a few that have waterfronts. Now these are non-electric sites, so don't expect that. But for a tent site on the water, I don't think you're going to beat that in many places. And then you have the whole park down here with all sorts of amenities. So that was Nicolay Bay and the campground that's associated with it. Looks like a great campground for tenters. If you don't need the power, if you're not trying to maneuver a big rig, there were some great tucked away sites that I don't, I wish I could show you better, but they were still in use. Um, although as you'd be walking in there and showing you how wonderful some of those nice sites are. Let me go just drive back through the right way. All right, first site near the amenities is 601, then 602 on my right. 603 on my left. 604 on my right, which is backed up to a volleyball pit. Um, 605 on my left, 606 on my right, 608 on my right, that's tucked back to way in there nicely 607 on my left which is a pull through has a nice off set off pad for tenting 60610 on my right 609 on my left which has another set off pad now we're starting to get closer to where you can have some fun on the water 612 on my right tuck down over there 611 on my left Come around the corner, 613 on my left, 615 on my left, 617 on my left, that sneaks way back in there, 614, it's hidden over here, and actually I'm going to back up and show you something about this one. Okay, if you can seek, so sneak through there, just parking is up front, but this particular camper seems to have taken their vehicle all the way back there and I don't know any other way to get there take their bikes and their kayaks which you can all be used at this location okay shower building on my left 616 on my right on the water 618 on my right has water access 619 on my left is the camp host. 621, a little pull through. 620 on my right has water access. 623 on my left, a nice pull through. 
622 on my right has access to the water. 624 on my right along the water. 625 on my left. Nice pad over there to set up. 626, kind of a pull through, but tucked. Way back in there is direct access to the water. See that there? Okay, 627 on my left. 628 on my right. Covers a lot of area. 630 on my right. 629 on my left. Let's see what 630 looks like. Eh, not too bad. 631 on the left. And that is out. So the last one on the water wasn't quite as on the water as some of the others. And then we come back out to the boat ramp, which is still a beautiful spot. So that is the Nicolet Bay area and campground. And a note, the Sunset Trail bike trail passes right through this campground and takes you down to that camp store. Alright, let's go look at the rest of the Nicolet Bay campsite. 700 through 7 or 8 72. So 700 to 798 is uh, this direction. We're kind of open here. 797 backed up to its neighbors. 794 on my left. 795 on my right. These are all non-electric. Good for tenting. 792 on my left. 790 on my left. Got a little vault toilet on my right. Seven eighty eight on my left. Seven eighty nine on my right. Seven ninety six on my left. 784 on my left, 787 over here on my right, 782 on my left, all very open between your near in your neighbors. There's not a lot of privacy out here. 785 on my right. 780 on my left and the camp host is over here. Let's continue around. Arrows, uh, let's go this way. It says I can go this way. Let's see if I'm going backwards or not. This looks like a brand new shower building here. I'm going to go around to my left and make a loop. Arrows say go this way, so. 822 on my left. Uh, 821 over on my right. 820 on my left. 819 on my right. 817 on my right, 818 on my left, 815 on my right, 816 on my left. These are all backed up to their neighbors with no real cover here. 814 on my left, 813 on my right, followed by 811 on my right. 812 is over here with the RV next to the water. 810 on my left, 809 on my right, 
808 on my left, 807 on my right, 806 on my left, 805 on my right, 804 on my left, which is actually a grassy spot. I am going to go right and see what I discover, which tells me I'm going to 872 to 804. So I think we've already done some of those. So this is closer to where you would have come in instead of from the shower building. Now this, as we come around, is right up against the day use park and the beach and the camp store off to my left 872 on my right I think we're coming up on some bonus waterfront camping 870 is waterfront camping 871 on my right 868 on my left is on the water 869 on my right 867 on my right. 866 on my right. Now some of these, since there's no sights on the left, have easy access to the water, but they're not on the water. 865 on my right. 863 on my right, 864 on the water on my left, 861 on my right, coming up on the shower building on my right, I'm going to keep going straight, 862 is on my left, tucked down in and on the water, 860 on my left on the water, 8. 58 on my left and on the water. 860 is way tucked down there. It's nicely tucked down. 857 on my right backs up to the shower building. 856 on my left on the water. 855 on my right. Actually, 856 is towards the water but not on the water. 853 on my right. 854 towards the water but not all the way down there 851 on my right 852 seems to have a little better view of the water on the left 859 on the right 850 on the left well, they packed an RV in there and a boat and their bikes they brought everything 857 on my right. 858 on my left. 854 on the right. Got two dogs going here. 856 on my left on the water. I've got a vault toilet on my right. A couple trails to my left that go between site 884 on the water and 842. Okay, I think we are done with the waterfront sites here. Alright, we're coming up on 840 on my left. Ooh, that one has electric. Well, there's a couple here with electric. Okay, we're going to follow around the outside circle. No, we're going to go inside. 838 to 804. And some of these we have seen already, so we'll only do part of it. These will take us back towards that shower building. 837 on my right. 838 on my left. These are electric. At least some of them are. 835 on my right, definitely electric. 836 on my left is electric. So we're going down the middle, we have electric. 833 on my right. 834 on my left. 831 on my right. 
These are fairly large, easy to get your vehicle into. 832 on my left. 829 on my right. 830 on my left. 827 on my right. 838 on my left. This definitely seems to be a popular place for bikers. For people who ride their bikes. 826 on my left. 825 on my right. Back up to the shower building here at 824 on my left. And 823 on my right if you want to be right at the shower. And we're going to go make another loop around. All right, we're coming back up on the split where 850 or 754 is. We're going to go straight this time with 838 to my right. 752 is on my left. These are electric. 750 on my left. There's a group campground hiding back there somewhere. 848 on my left, 846 on my left. Some good space here, space between your neighbors. But they're squeezed in here quite a bit. Uh, what is that site with the big RV? It's 844, 841 on my right is squeezed in a fifth wheel. 842 on my left. 839 on my right, 870 on the left with lots of room to maneuver. 837 on my right, 838 on my left. All these sites are fairly wide, so no problem with your pop outs. So, oh, sorry, we're in the sevens. That was 738, 735. Sorry to confuse you, we're in the 700. 736 on my left, 733 on my right, 734 on my left, 731 on my right. It's got a tree in the middle of the site to dance around, 732 on my left, 729 on my right, 730 on my left. That one tucks back nicely. 727 on my right, and again, these are still electric. 728 on my left, 725 on my right, 726 on my left, 723 on my right, 724 on my left. Ooh, it gets a little bit of color going on up here. 721 over here with a colorful tree. 722 on my left. Got a crossroads there. We're going to continue down. 720 on my left. 717 on my right. 718 on my left. 715 on the right. 716 on the left. 714 on the left, 713 on the right. Still all electric sites. 711 on the right. 712 I just passed on the left. 709 on the right, 710 on the left. Not a lot of cover between you and your, you and your neighbors, but there's space. 708 on the left. 707 six on the left there's nothing on the right at the moment some of these sites are backing up to the park road it looks like 703 on my right now 704 on my left 701 on my right 702 on my left 700 straight ahead 700 straight ahead. And we're going to go back up this middle road. You know, I think I'm confused because there's two shower buildings. That's my confusion. I got a nice shower building on the right. 
I don't think it's the only one. 776 on my left. I've definitely not been here before. 779 on my right. 774 on my left. I hope you're following along at home with a map. 77, 777 on my right. 772 on my left. All electric. 775 on my right. 770 on my left. 773 on my right. I have a vault toilet on my left. 771 on my right. 769 on my right. 7. 68 on my left, 780, 67 on my right, 766 on my left, 765 on my right, 764 on my left, 763 on my right, 762 on my left, 761 on my right, and we have been here before because the group campground is straight ahead. So yes, that was a road I was looking for that I knew I hadn't hit yet. Okay, so the campsites are broken into Northern Nicolay Bay and Nicolay Bay campsites. Um, so that was the Nicolay Bay that I just went through in the 700s and 800s. So that was South Nicolay Bay campground. What I somehow managed to miss recording was the distance from the two shower buildings. They were not that far apart. One was just up the hill from the other. Um, really nice group campsites here, uh, really nice campsites near that big park for Nicolay Bay with all the access, several sites on the water. Um, definitely, I, I'm curious if those cost more. They're non-electric sites. All the sites that were on the water are non-electric, but they are sort of a premium site. I'm sure those book up early. But hopefully this helps you know which ones actually have good waterfront access and will help you pick your perfect site depending on your equipment and needs.